Okay, so now we get to talk about our nails and our shoes. I know, everybody loves that. But we're not talking about your normal mani and pedi. Unfortunately, we're talking about super short nails. Now I know nobody ever wants to have the super short nails. Well, maybe if you're a guy. But for a harpist, this is invaluable. Because if you have long nails, when you're playing the harp, they will start to catch. And when they catch, it's a big problem. Because as you're playing, especially as you're playing faster, if your nails catch, it slows down your movement and it throws off your timing and your fine motor skills. So it can really mess up what's going on later on in the piece. Now, I know some of us really like the French manicure look, even in a short nail, but those sharp corners, it's not, gonna, it's not really a good idea because even those can catch a little bit too. So you're really want, going to want a nice round nail close to the quick. I have just a little bit of growth on my nails and that's about as far as you want to go. Now we're going to talk about shoes. You're going to want to wear heels, ladies. And men, you get to wear heels too. Basically, this is for a reason that it makes it easier when you shift your pedals because your heel is higher off the ground and your ankle is not going to be at an as acute an angle. And this is going to be even more important when you're talking about the inner pedals as well. Now guys, you don't have to wear stilettos, but you're going to want to find a nice dress shoe with about an inch of a heel on it. And for the exact same reason, it just makes it easier to shift the pedals. Now, just remember that you are going to want to practice your harp every day in the heels. It's good for training and it makes it easier for later on.